Yo, what's up guys? My name's Hacky, and you probably heard about the new Acid Lab business in GTA Online, and you might be wondering how you're supposed to set it up, because at first, even I was confused. I was looking through the internet trying to buy it, and little did I know you can't actually buy it on the internet like with all the other properties and businesses. We're gonna break it down and make it as simple as possible, step by step to how you can get it going. So before we talk about starting to set up the Acid Lab, it's important to note that the Acid Lab is inside of the Brickade which is inside of the freak shop the freak shop is the big property that the whole acid lab business is in and the acid lab room inside of the brickade is relatively small we first need to unlock the freak shop property and how you do that is by doing just one mission so to unlock the freak shop you're required to do just one mission and then to unlock the acid lab you need to do a total of six missions along with a few extras that you don't have to do and we'll talk about that a little bit more later on to start the first mission log into GTA Online line obviously and then after being outside for a little bit you're gonna get a call from Ron I think it is and then you get an R icon on the map you go to that R icon which is at a liquor store next to Sandy Shores and then you'll get a cutscene with Ron and some other people including Dax which is the new contact if you guys don't know that's gonna start up a little mission you have to do you're basically in a shootout against like motorcycle gangs and there's a good amount of driving you have to do in that mission as well once you complete that mission you're gonna get a payout of about 30 thousand dollars and you unlock the freak shop property which is under like the big highway intersection in los santos if you know where that is after you complete that first mission at that point you basically got dax's trust and then it's a new contact on your phone now after you go inside the freak shop for the first time you can check it out for a little bit and then once you go outside near the entrance of the freak shop you'll have a d icon on the map for dax and then you can go in that yellow circle press by d-pad to start up the rest of the five missions you need to do and by the way you can do every single mission solo if you wanted to but if you do have friends online ideally they could help you and make it just a little bit faster since you probably want to finish a little bit quicker but just so you know it's one to four players and if you lost count of which mission you're on the final sixth mission you need to do is the one where you cut open the cargo crates on the train and once you complete that one you are basically good to go now the next step is to go to one of the three rival acid laps that are going to be marked on the map they're going to be like like smiley faces and like yellow and black and in there I was really struggling because what you need to do is first off take out a couple guards and then you need to drive a forklift then take three crates and put them on the back of a truck this was an absolute pain for me just because it's not that hard to either flip them over or just drop them and if you accidentally mess them up and flip them over like me it is going to be a hassle to flip them back over right side up if you're in need of these services check out daymods.com in the description Description. They offer some of the fastest and safest cash and rank services plus modded accounts as well for both the last gen and the next gen version of the game and they have lots of trusted reviews by their customers. Plus the forklift is very slow so try to be patient there. It's gonna take some effort and then you just take the truck and deliver it back to the freak shop and then we are done with that. Finally at this point the acid lab is now pretty much ready for us. The next step is to go up to someone named Mutt which is gonna be like the vehicle workshop guy. He's gonna be standing on the side. You go up to him, press right d-pad and then it's gonna cost most of us $750,000 to unlock the acid lab inside of the brickade. But for GTA Plus members it is going to be free for you. That's one of the benefits with GTA Plus. Now with running the acid lab it works similarly to stuff we're already familiar with which is either stealing supplies or sourcing some supplies for an x amount of money from mutt then it's going to fill up the product bar and then after a bit you can go and sell the supplies and for those wondering how much it actually sells for a full supply of the acid lab sells for just under two hundred and forty thousand dollars. there is also a high demand bonus which applies to selling in public sessions so if you sell in a public session you will get some sort of bonus if you know what amount the bonus is make sure to comment down below and let us know now with the acid lab equipment upgrade which is like more missions that you can do through DAX which basically gets you more money when selling it at the end. A full supply with the lab equipment upgrade is going to sell for $335,000 and to get the equipment upgrade you need to call DAX and then just request work and then you'll need to complete 10 disruption missions and unfortunately there's a cooldown between them so maybe we can bypass that somehow who knows and after finally completing those 10 disruption missions just go back to Matt and then you can 
add that upgrade to your acid lab. I really just called him Matt. Well, his name is Mutt with a U instead of an A. I don't know why Mutt and not Matt, because I've never heard of Mutt. You know what? Screw it. I'm just going to call him Matt from now on. Through Matt, you can upgrade your brocade, so you can customize the actual brocade vehicle itself, and you can customize the inside of the actual acid lab. Drop a like if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe with a bell on if you did find it helpful as well. It takes only two seconds, and it really helps out the channel. And if you want to check out the big spending spree video I did on the Drug Wars DLC, click the video on screen now. I hope you all enjoy that video, and peace.